I got asked this question this morning. I've already mowed the grass. I couldn't mow the whole lawn. It's too hot and dry. I've weed whacked all the weeds. There's plenty of them. And I'm like, you know what? Let me come back into the house where it's a little bit cool and answer this question with a video. LinkedIn's a professional networking site, but it's also a search engine for jobs. Can you filter job listings by industry, location, experience level, and more? I'm going to show you what you can do in LinkedIn when searching for jobs. I'm going to go to LinkedIn. Here I am right here. I'm going to go up top here and I'm going to look for project manager. I'm going to spell it right too. Now, if I want to be very purposeful, I'll put quotes around that. Because if you put quotes around it, it's going to search for project manager, not job listings that have the word project and job listings that has the word manager. The word manager. So I put quotes around it. Could have put the capital A and D. Would have got me the same value results. Do jobs. Now I'm in the job search function of LinkedIn. And I can, it's showing me 51,662 jobs. And I can create an alert to get more of these, but I haven't filtered it enough. Let me show you what you can do. First of all, yeah, I can do date posted, experience level, salary range to co companies, remote, hybrid, uh, you know, on site, et cetera. Easy apply, if that's an easy apply option. But look here under all filters. Let's go play with that. Now look here, these are the filters that we have the ability to do when filtering only jobs by, first of all, I can, I can change the sort by most recent or most relevant. I can search for date posted anytime, the past week, past month, or past 24 hours. Those are the only options there. I can come down here to experience level and I have six options in the experience level and I can choose multiple of those. I can come down to company and I can search for jobs only relevant to these would look like 10 companies or I can add another company here and type the company name in. These are definitely um, companies that have a job listed. That's why they show up there. I can search for job type, full-time contract, et cetera, et cetera. Again, only these options, and I can choose multiple of these filters. I can choose uh, any of remote, on-site, hybrid, remote, or a combination of those three. I can say I only want easy apply. I can say I want jobs, and this is really interesting. I don't get this. It says I can only look for jobs that are project manager in these in these locations that's kind of strange why would it only give me these 10 it doesn't let me go to others in here I really don't understand why now i can go up here and change it here i can put in north carolina and go there but when i come over here to all filters and I come down here to location, it doesn't let me change. Now, it lets me drill in to more North Carolina locations now that I've typed the location up here. But furthermore, there's industry. I can use any of these 10 plus add other industries. Here's job function, any of these 10 plus add others. Titles, again, interestingly enough, I only get these 10, I don't get the ability to add others. Don't understand that. Maybe I would need to put that title in this field here if I was looking for a specific title. And then I got some uh, one item filters under 10 apps in your network. Fair chance employer. Have to read that to see what it's referring to. Here's salary uh, range above 40,000, above 200,000, et cetera, et cetera. Benefits, again, I got one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four, five, six. I got 11 options there. And then commitments. Those are all of the filters that I have the ability to use, including I have the ability to put unique keywords, phrases in here. Uh, I can do project manager. I can do this and... I can put executive, and I can use the or, 
Well, I can use, this is called a Boolean string. Do a search for Boolean strings there. I can do any kind of searching strings there. Use the filters that are across the top and go to all filters to get the full list. And when you do that, you're going to drive this list of jobs down to a much smaller list focused on what's important to you, which would be far more beneficial to work that list than to work a huge list. I'm Teddy, your LinkedIn strategist, trainer, and coach. I hope these ideas about how to filter in LinkedIn jobs is helpful for you.